In today's video, I'll demonstrate how to craft CGI advertisements like this one. Let's dive in and take a closer look. Here's our footage in After Effects. Locate the 3D camera tracker and simply drag and drop it onto the footage. Wait patiently until the tracking process is complete. After the tracking is complete, you'll notice numerous tracking points. Select three of these points, then opt to create a solid and camera. Now, it's time to adjust the orientation of the solid to match the perspective. I'm satisfied with how this looks. Okay, now let's copy the camera data. Navigate to the AE2 Blend Add-in in Blender and click on Create Camera. Excellent, our camera is now ready for use. If you've watched my recent videos, you'll notice that I consistently use the AE2 Blend Add-in to seamlessly transfer camera and solid data from After Effects to Blender. Next, let's copy the solid data and then in Blender, click on Create Solid. Select the camera, then add the background footage. Click on Background Image, choose Add Image. Then select Movie, and open the footage from your downloaded folder. The link to the footage is provided in the description. Set the focal length to 30mm, and the FPS to 59.94. Adjust the solid size and shape to match the front part of the building. Inset the faces and then extrude them. Navigate to the Material tab and add a material. Then, add another new material. In Edit Mode, Select the side extruded faces and change the material from principal BSDF to holdout. Finally, assign it. Now that the side part is invisible, we need to repeat this process for other parts as well. Perfect. Let's go into edit mode, select the back part, duplicate it, and then separate it. Great! So this will serve as the glass cover. Go to object, set the origin, and then select surface. Let's add the HDRI. Go to the World Settings, then select Environment Texture. Open the HDRI file. Uncheck Transparent to view the HDRI's position. Navigate to the Shading tab. Change the object to World, then press Ctrl plus T. Now, adjust the rotation, size, and position of the HDRI. Let's add the glass material to this object. Experiment with the roughness and IOR settings. Next, import the model and place it inside the box.
All right, let's subdivide this glass material first. Then, navigate to the Quick Effects menu and select Quick Explode. Let's animate the jar. Next, render the animation as PNG frames. When the rendering is complete, import it into After Effects as a PNG sequence, and you're all set. Thank you for watching. I hope you found this tutorial helpful in creating CGI advertisements. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more content. If you have any questions or suggestions for future tutorials, feel free to leave them in the comments below. See you next time.